Thank you very much. Come back soon. Get the other half of my tip. <laughs> hey, Sheldon, what are you doing here? This is a restaurant. It's lunchtime. I would think as a waitress she'd be familiar with the paradigm. <laughs> is Leonard coming? No, I believe Leonard is waiting for you to come crawling back to him and apologize. <laughs> well, that's not gonna happen. I assume that would be your attitude, hence my true purpose in coming here. Which is? I want you to crawl back to him and apologize. <laughs> I'm busy. Excuse me, miss. I'd like to order lunch. Fine. What do you want? I have a few questions. First, I noticed that you offer soup and a half sandwich. Yes. Where exactly does the half sandwich come from? Are you giving me half of someone else's sandwich? Or do I have to wait for someone else in the restaurant to order the other half? No, no, Sheldon, they just make a half sandwich. You can't make a half sandwich. If it's not half of a whole sandwich, it's just a small sandwich. Okay, fine. It's soup and a small sandwich. Is that what you want? No, of course not. I'll have my usual. <laughs> Great. But aren't you going to ask me if I want a beverage? Don't you usually get lemonade? Yes. You want lemonade? Yes. Anything else? Yes, I want you to apologize to Leonard. <laughs> I am not going to apologize. I've done nothing wrong. He is completely overreacting. Irrelevant. The disruption in your relationship is making my life intolerable. <laughs> well, I'm sorry, Sheldon, but this really isn't about you. I don't follow. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll be right there. Look, Sheldon, I have to go. All right. Let's assume, ad arguendum, that in this case, Leonard is wrong. Leonard is wrong. Considering the number of transgressions you've committed that he's overlooked, don't you think that just this once you could return the favor? I'm coming. Goodbye, Sheldon. What do you mean, transgressions I've committed? <laughs> Were you under the impression that Leonard has no complaints about you? Like what? I, yeah, yeah, I see you. You're making a little check sign in the air. I got it. Just hold your horses. <laughs> what does Leonard complain about? Your driving? The plethora of stuffed animals on your bed that stare at him during your amorous activities? <laughs> Your constant tardiness, your singing. My singing? That's actually from my list, but Leonard be a fool if he didn't agree with it. Okay, if Leonard has so many problems with me, why hasn't he just said so? Because according to him, you're oversensitive and have a temper. Oh, really? Well, then do me a favor and tell Leonard that he can drop dead. And she wonders why she's constantly under-tipped.